Hello everyone. Today I will be presenting you logic-based ranking of assertions in inconsistent A boxes. This is a joint work with my supervisor Jeff Weising. In description logics, usually inconsistency presents in two forms: the first, T box unsatisfiability, and the second, A box inconsistency. In our line of work, we always assume that the T box is error-free, so that left us with the A box inconsistent problem and how to solve it. Our proposition is an A box assessment. What it is, is a real number credibility score that will take into account the T box and the structure, also the expert knowledge, and then rank the A box assertions. In this example of a really simple knowledge base of a university, we can already see that there is a problem. John is a professor and also John attends the knowledge representation course. Following the T-box, this is an inconsistency. And then our A-box assessment should reflect that. Each assertion should hinder the score of the other. In the same way, John teaches the database course should imply, should reinforce our credibility of the fact that John is a professor. We can visualize this using uh, a graph of supporters and refuters, where the edges are positive and negative following the positive and negative interactions, and where the nodes are group of assertions. Our intuition was, was to use this structure to compute a score alike of Google's page rank. Alike, but uh, different. The first difference is that we allow for negative edges, that is, we take into account positive and negative interactions in our graph, in our structure. Second, we don't only have binary relationships, but also in error relationships, where, for example, when we have a group of assertions with a positive uh, edge to our, to our an assertion, it means that the whole group of assertion is supporting the assertion and not only a subset of the group in the same way for the negative assertions. Uh, third, we used expert knowledge for a, in, an initial credibility and we will teach to enhance our scores. In a more formal way, a, a box assessment is a function new, sorry, that goes from the A box to the real numbers. This function will induce a pre-order on the A box and we will use this order to pick, to choose between assertions when they are conflicting, we will pick the one with the higher new value. Because we are only interested in the order that comes from the function, whenever two different assessments, new one and new two, give the same order, we call them rank equivalents and they are the same at our eyes. Thus, we are really interested in the family of ABOS assessments, modular rank equivalents. For the use of the T box, we define what supporters and refuters are. Uh, informally, a supporter is an inclusion minimal subset of the A box such that it is consistent and also it implies alpha, where alpha is an assertion in the A box. A refuter is defined in the same way, only that it implies not alpha. We can see supporters and refuters as arguments, well founded arguments that are in favor and against. And session. We, we put the user credibility in the user expertise in a credibility function. A credibility function is a map from the A box to the real numbers that can then be extended to the subsets of the A box to the real numbers. We combine all of this in a unique uh, equality. This equality, when you have a knowledge base TA and a credibility, credibility function F, the assessment new for every alpha in the A box say this, the assessment of alpha should be equal to a minimal value and this minimal value will then be influenced by the credibility of supporters and refuters. Also, the credibility of supporters and refuters, the initial credibility should then be influenced by the assessment of assertions that are present in such supporters and refuters. We then introduce two parameters, A and B, that are real numbers to control the force uh, of the influence of supporters and refuters in each assessment. We then use 
this system of equality for every assertion in the A box to, to deduce our, our assessments. Our results, the first is about the existence. Whenever you have a, a fixed value B strictly positive, then we can find A that is greater than B such that uh, the solution for the system of equalities is unique. We have an unique assessment of the A box. Second, the, assess the assessment uh, stabilized, that is, we can compute the threshold T star, strictly positive, such that whenever the ratio AB is greater than T star, then the assessment that we found, they are all uh, wrong equivalents. And third, the assessment are tractable. Uh, if the T-box uh, allows for an upper bound on the size of supporters and refuter, then the, this unique uh, family of modulo rank equivalence assessment can be computed in polynomial time. The contributions. Uh, we define a new framework for ranking A-box assertions in terms of their quality, their credibility. What? This uh, assessment can use any function as the initial credibility function. It allows also for any DL uh, language that implements uh, negation. The assessment is found, is found in linear algebra and also uh, shown to be computationally tractable in a setting of practical relevance. For in the future, we will uh, implement our framework and test it in real life applications. We will investigate the relationships between our framework and existing inconsistency theorem semantics and also explore the possibility of hybrid semantics combining our framework with existing semantics. Thank you, and I'm open to questions.